Hello, guys. Today we're going to learn about how to log into a library account. And I'll show you two different libraries and how they're kind of set up. And the layouts and stuff will be different too. So sometimes they'll say log in right where my cursor is or sometimes they'll say my account. It really just depends. And then we'll do log in. And then we'll put in our library card number and our PIN, which is sometimes the last four digits of your library card or the last four digits of your number. It just really depends on the library's policies and procedures on how they uh, set that up. But they will give it to you once they give you your library card. Sometimes you need to ask because they for forget it. And then we'll do log in. And then here it'll show you what items you have out and you can renew them online if you want. There are some libraries that will give you automatic renewals and some that won't, but you can just renew them online. Ever how many they decided renews they decided to uh, set up. And then you can look how many requests you might have to pick up or like how many requests you are requ you've requested but haven't come in yet and fines and fees in this one you can see which when your expiration date is and your last activity and when you registered and under contact and preferences, you can see if they entered anything right or wrong. One time it happened to me, they got one of the words in my email wrong. And next time I went up to that library, I said, oh, this is wrong. Can you change it? And they did. Again, you can check for fines and fees if you have any and some libraries will let you pay online and some of them won't you have to go in and go into the library and pay it just really depends on how they've set it up and here's another library with a different um, layout so then again we'll enter our library card number in our pan and this one, I have to actually go to my account at the top to pull up the account. As you see, the layout's a bit different too. So you can see, again, your personal information, your checkouts, your holds and fines and that sort of thing. You can uh, search for books on the online catalog before you go in and anything on hold before you go in. So what, like the day before, so you can just go ahead and just pick them right up. It's really cool. So I hope this has been helpful. If you have any comments, questions, or concerns, just drop them down in the comments below. Hope this helps. Thank you. Bye.